feeling warm heading into the weekend, Dustin. I did notice some dark clouds out there every once in a while. Mm. What are we looking at? More rain. Mm. Lansing hasn't seen any of that really today, but our southern counties have seen a few showers, probably heard some rumbles of thunder. As we get into tomorrow, we'll all be seeing oh. a very soggy Saturday morning and afternoon. Oh, okay, yeah. well, get your crib ready, right? An umbrella. <laughs> get it ready, you guys. Oh, yeah, yeah. Have a look. Local radar today has been somewhat calm, somewhat busy. These are not strong showers or storms by any means. Uh, a lot of us in the northern half of mid-Michigan have barely seen a raindrop, but our southern counties still catching a few of those rain showers now. No thunder in this. These are weak little spotty showers. But as we get later on into tomorrow, it will be much more strong. We'll see some more thunderstorms in the mix. Temperatures right now, mid 70s to about 80. It's 80 currently Mason, Jackson, Charlotte, 79 in Lansing. Very good warm temperatures. So There'll be good fuel for some thunderstorms as we get into tomorrow. We should also reach those mid 70s tomorrow. And along with that, it's feeling a little bit more humid. Yeah, dew point is about 60. And around the region, still got a lot of cloud cover, spotty, disorganized rain. I mean, there's a lot of weak showers nearby. That's going to be the story for later this evening and tonight. Spotty little bits of rain. But as we go through your weather headlines, we're going to break it down a bit further. Rain tonight, it's not looking like a lot. Spotty showers in the evening possible. More rain after midnight still. But thunderstorms into early Saturday morning and a lot of Saturday afternoon too could result in some heavy rainfall. Now we're not looking at the severe weather forecast, not really, but very soggy downpours, things of that nature. A few showers still to linger on Sunday. That is a change from what I was saying yesterday. A few showers are looking likely just to kind of hang on as we get into Sunday morning and early to mid-afternoon. May not be much. Saturday is the more active day. As we go through your future track tonight, there's really not a lot going on for the rest of the evening. Might still see a few passing showers. And then after midnight, still similar story. A few passing showers are possible. But the more widespread rains, here we go, into early Saturday morning, by 8 a.m., we should all be seeing some thunderstorms. Notice a lot of the oranges, the reds, heavy rainfall in the mix. That continues all the way through Saturday lunchtime and through much of Saturday afternoon before we start to finally see some calmer weather. And that'll be by Saturday night. Still could see some lingering rain through Saturday evening, but I think by Saturday night, calms down a little bit. And then into Sunday's forecast, this low pressure really just wants to hang around, not go anywhere anytime soon. And we could see a few lingering rain showers through at least Sunday afternoon. It does dry up by Monday. 60, your overnight low. More rain is looking likely later on. Just spotty showers, though. It's tomorrow that we see more scattered thunderstorms with some heavy rain in the mix. Highs around 76. That might vary a bit depending on how much rain we get in one spot or another. But mid-70s as well on Sunday. A few showers there. Monday looks dry. So does most of Tuesday. Warm on Tuesday. Tuesday night, likely to see our next round of thunderstorms. Some of those could be on the strong side, possibly. A lot of warm weather nearby. This is not the best forecast for MIS weekend. So Sunday's the big race day. Yeah. Just be prepared. Still might see some rain. Exactly. Preparation is key. Mm. Well, thanks, Dustin, for all that information. You